back to everything Mini. How are you guys and how are you doing? I can't believe this is me saying welcome back to my channel. It's so unreal. I always have to pinch myself every time. This is me telling you believe in yourself and never procrastinate anything in life okay so guys this is part two of our house drawer and I am seated at my dining table um, I have this centerpiece guys I've had this um, centerpiece for the longest like since I was I don't know, young girl in Nairobi, hustling, <laughs> um, and I love it. It's so beautiful, and guys, I've never seen or come across something like this. I just love it. It's so beautiful, you know. Um, I usually put plastic flowers, guys. Yo, do you know how real flowers are expensive in this Nairobi? Okay, for me, it's always selling my shinjang. Okay, so. Um, I work with um, these plastic flowers. All I do just to maintain them is um, wash them. Yes, you can wash plastic flowers. I think I should do that and show you guys how I do that. And uh, just to keep them clean. Um, I like how I mix up the colors. Beautiful. I love this. Um, yeah, so I have a bit of color here. So we have my black and white. Guys, I'm a black and white kind of chick. If you know, you know. Please tell me in the comment section. I don't know, it's just it's so classy and I like how it has a gold ring, um, beautiful. And like I said, guys, you know, work with what you want. You can have blue in your living area and still have a red napkin. It doesn't have to be a blue napkin because everything else is blue. I have my champagne flutes, very simple. I wanted to do a DIY and I think I will do that with you. Just add a bit of shimmer here. You know on the stem and I think it will also be classy and beautiful so this is um, a crystal color and we have my glass here my water glass and it's a bit a bit like rosé or gold also just to blend in with everything um, I love candles um, honestly guys these are um, affirmation candles I bought them online and this one says I am kind and I am guys I'm one person who believes, in, and I say that in episode one of Real Houses of Nairobi, be kind to people because you don't know what people are going through. So this just reminds me, be kind, right? Please be kind, guys. Um, guess what, guys? I still have my Christmas runner. <laughs> um, the snowflake runner. It's beautiful. I just don't want to remove it. And it's so easy to wash. It has this feel of um, paper, it's not cloth, so it's easy to wash off, especially if Simone is, um, Simone is my daughter, if she's having dinner here or lunch and she messes up and I just can clean it very well. So I still have it, I still keep it. I still have my cloth ones that actually, that match you know, the aesthetics of the dining, but I love it. I chose an eight-seater dining because guys, if you know me, you know I really want a big family. I want like four kids, five, six. Why not? I look at the Kardashian family and I'm like, oh, look at how Chris just feels good because she has all these children and once they grow up, it's, it's a big family and I love that. So this is me manifesting a very big family. Um, I love it. It's white. Um, it's leather. Very easy to wash off. Um, does not stain. It has a sort of a champagne wood um, trim on it which is also good kind of works with the gold around the house um, so like I said I love I love a big dining set my former dining set was also at eight seater tell me guys what do you prefer also I feel like the price difference of a six seater and the eight seater is so I mean the price range is, I mean they're joking it could be like 20k off why not? I love it here. You'll find most of the time we're here having dinner. My husband has this strict rule. Actually, that is rule number three. If you have white lounge chairs, please make sure you eat from your dining set, okay? Um, so my husband has this strict rule where we have to eat at the dining table, say our prayers, say our grace, and you know, 
just dine together. So most of the time when you're having our dinner, lunch, on a Sunday, maybe brunch, we usually do it here. Um, nothing much guys. I just wanted to show you how, someone asked me how do I um, place my ribbons, why do they look so big and flurry? <laughs> so guys, it's so simple. I think I will do this on my Instagram. It's so simple. I also follow um, a lot of, I mean, influencers. So guys, you can also have a red napkin, yet your, you know, your decor pieces are blue. Just as long as it's aesthetically pleasing, that's okay. Go with your vibe, as long as it makes sense. We have so many colors that go together. We have, um, I don't know, green, lime, yellow. As long as it makes sense, that's okay. So my dining is a bit of red, white, a blush of black somewhere, gold. And I love it. You guys also were asking how do I set up my dining area. I think that video I'll do separately. How to, you know, fold your napkins in a very beautiful, aesthetically pleasing way. I think I'll do that video for you guys. It's very simple, by the way. So watch out for that video, how to set up your dining area. I love this space. Oh, you're still there. <laughs> Guys, let's continue the house tour and please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Everything Mine. Um, so, we have this beautiful mirror. I wanted a mirror that is big, guys, and is arced on the top. Um, gold, of course, um, and big. Mirrors actually tend to make spaces bigger, and that was the whole point of this beautiful mirror. Custom made by Paintwall Designs. I will link her Instagram handles and her socials right here on this video, please, guys. Go order this beautiful, beautiful mirror and tell her that Unataka Kamaya Mine. So this is where we have breakfast, CC, daddy, mommy, you know. Um, at around 6.30 a.m. 7 when we are busy taking our breakfast before we start our day, this is where you find us. I love this um, custom made bar stools, also done by Barishi Interiors. And for me guys, like I said, it's all about functionality and the fact that they have armrests, you know. Have you ever found bar stools that don't even have armrests? It's uncomfortable, right? So the fact that it has an armrest, um, you know, it's, it's sizable, like, I, I'm not really struggling to eat my breakfast, so we had to do, we had to really measure that, and it's blue, I love it, it's beautiful, and it's very comfortable, guys, I told you, Varishi does an amazing job, look at the finishing, guys, beautiful, quality, Varishi interiors. So I just have a bit of um, deco here. I bought this deco pieces, I think in Furniture Palace. Yes, yeah, so like I told you, I buy my things locally. Why not? Um, just some beautiful flowers, just to add a bit of brightness in our morning. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel? Please do like this video if you like it. Also share, comment. Tell me, how do you like this house tour so far? You like it? Let me know. <laughs> So guys, I want us to move to my server. So guys, this is um, the buffet area, the buffet table, or what people call the server. So this is where, if I have, I'm having guests around, this is where I'll maybe put the, the food. This is the serving area. I also wanted it very white, um, clean. Na pia na kangapo tiyombo za wageni. By the way, guys, don't judge me. Minu le kama mama zetu. Na panga na tiyombo za wageni. Yes, it's really important. Okay? Have you ever, like, it has happened to me once. You want to serve your guests and the plates are not plating. They're not matching. You will be bought 12 pieces of maybe your beautiful um, Chinese plates. And one is broken. One you cannot be seen. So, please just to protect me from the mess and embarrassment. So this is where I put um, my beautiful glasses, my crystal glasses, my flutes, everything, my hot pots, everything. And it's big enough to accommodate all that. So, just to light up this space, I have a similar chandelier to the one that I have in the living area. It's bigger, you know, and it, it's able to light up the space. And it's beautiful, it's crystal. Look how beautiful this place is. So guys, let's head on to the kitchen. I love the kitchen. Let's go. Guys, 
welcome to one of the best spaces here in my home, the kitchen. Um, I don't know, there's something about just being in the kitchen as a woman, I don't know about you, but I love cooking. Um, cooking is very therapeutic, please try it. Um, again, it's white, I love it here, it's big, it's spacious. Um, I love cooking for my family, so this is one of the best spaces and rooms in the house for me. Um, I have a cookbook that is very organic, so sometimes you want to cook your veggies, organic food. Um, you know, I like decorating the work tables. Why not? I feel like um, this is a space that I like really personalizing and just have some candles some greenery it's beautiful and i like it here um i want to cook for you very soon so a cooking video is dropping very soon of course the cabinets are white um very easy to clean like i said white is a color that is very easy to clean once it's stained you notice the color wipe it off so i hope you love it guys this is a coffee station this is where my husband comes and grabs himself coffee we have a coffee machine there I am not a coffee person, okay? I'm telling you what I'm saying. So, how about you? Um, I really want to move um, the coffee station from here to somewhere over there in that corner. I really want to renovate a few things here in my kitchen, and trust me, guys, I will do that with you, okay? So, that has been my kitchen, guys. I hope you like it. Um, and I hope, you know, it's like when I know you're house tour, when I feel, when I feel. <laughs> so guys, watch out for part three of the house tour. I'll take you to the family room. I'll take you to my master bedroom. You see where things go down. <laughs> thank you so much for watching, guys. Please subscribe, comment, like, and thank you so much, guys. This is everything. Me.